Well, Thanksgiving Day will bring a competition that one and a half year old Edgar Fleming from Silver Spring has been training for his whole life. Yeah, though he is a teenager in dog years, <laughs> the young pup is hoping to win it all at the 2023 National Dog Show here on NBC4. Before the Best in Show competition, Tommy McFly caught up with Edgar and his owner, Kevin, in the scene. Even as a middle school student, I'd beg, instead of going to, you know, Houston Park, can we go to dog show, please? Kevin Fleming grew up around dog shows, watching his godmother compete. This is his first um, kind of very prestigious national show, particularly as a champion. Edgar, the Manchester Terrier, also grew up around dog shows. Soon he'll heel into his biggest competition yet. In terms of the Kennel Club and National Dog Show, this definitely is our first entry and definitely one of our most competitive ones. We're going to give, give it a shot. <laughs> the very good boy from Silver Spring, Edgar has a dozen AKC titles, can sprint 23 miles an hour, loves his braided rope toy, and snacks on chicken, peanut butter, and ice cubes. He's a pet first, a dog show second, so he definitely loves performing. He likes being in the show, likes being a show off <laughs> as well. At the other side of the leash, Kevin is a teacher first. I teach high school and these public schools. I'm a teacher in Cardozo Education Campus. Um, I teach physics, uh, botany, and AP Biology. Kids know about the dog show. They, some of them ask about Edgar a lot. A lot of kids have dogs at home. Aside from best in show aspirations, Edgar is also working on a side hustle. Edgar has come to school twice. Um, he's working on being trained as a therapy dog to support our students. Positive thing to bring to school to get kids and have a happier day. <laughs> Dog Show 101, a quick lesson of what to watch for. In confirmation, you have just a slip lead. There's an objectivity to it and a subjectivity to it. So you have the head nice and up and high, and then you stack them, have their front feet lined up nice. Judges are looking at a standard and, and assessing how well they meet to the standards. Stand for me, thank you. You see a nice top line. There's always interpretation of each judge on that, but they're grounded in a standard. It's not just opinion of who's the prettiest dog. Edgar, we're rooting for you. You sit. Thank you. With the scene. Edgar, can you spin? Good boy. Tommy McFly. Have your paw. Paw, thank you. News 4.